Good day everyone! I hope you are all doing fine. For this video, we will talk about preparing poultry and game dishes. Poultry refers to domesticated birds that are grown for eggs and food. These domesticated birds are grown for human consumption and this includes chickens and turkeys, duck, goose, pigeon, and other game birds. Before we dig into our lesson, here are our learning targets. Number one, I can identify the types of poultry. Two, I can identify the market forms of poultry. And last, I can name poultry cuts in accordance with prescribed dish. Types of poultry Chicken Chicken is by far the most popular poultry species utilized for both meat and egg production. Chicken meat consumption has replaced beef as the primary meat consumed and egg consumption is steady and expected to increase. Duck Ducks and geese are sometimes grouped together as waterfowl. In many other countries, particularly in Asia, ducks are the most popular form of poultry. Goose The goose is related to the duck and can live by by eating grass. This is popular in some cultures. Turkey The turkey is a domesticated variety of an American wild bird. It is used for meat products and is quite popular in Australia. Game birds Game is a word which is properly applied to a wild creatures that are hunted for food. They are also sometimes called wildfowl. Many game birds have now been domesticated but are still called game. In Australia, these include pheasant, guinea fowl, quail, partridge, and squab pigeon. Other species of bird are used mainly for producing meat but some produce eating eggs also. Market Forms of Poultry Chicken are sold in the market in different forms. Some people buy whole dressed chicken while the others prefer chicken in specialized cut. Whole Chicken These are marketed either fresh or frozen and is considered as a best buy and cheaper. Cuts These are whole chicken that is cut into different parts. Roast chicken Usually a whole chicken that is cooked through dry heat in the oven or open fire. Ready to cook These are poultry parts which have been separately packed in a single container. These are pre-marinated and are usually frozen or chilled. Different cuts of poultry Whole chicken this refers to the whole bird without the head and giblets. Halves The chicken is split from front to back through the backbone and keel to produce two halves of approximately equal weight. Breast Chicken breast is the part attached to the breast. It is definitely one of the most popular cuts of chicken as it is a rich source of protein and low in fat. Chicken breast is very versatile as it tastes awesome grilled, pan-fried, oven-roasted, or stuffed. It also tastes great in salads. Drumstick The portion between the knee joint and hock or the lower part of the leg is called drumstick. It does not include the thigh. Drumsticks are favorite finger food and ideal for baking or barbecuing. Legs. A chicken leg includes drumstick and thigh together. It is the whole leg and the cat starts at the hip joint. Tenders. These are little bits of tender meat under each chicken breast. 
tenders are not more than one and a half inches in size and totally delicious when fried. Since they are smaller than the breast cut, they are more moist and make great finger food such as chicken fingers, chicken gujons, chicken strips, or chicken fillets. Thigh Chicken thigh is just above the knee joint. It can be bought with the bone and skin or boneless and skinless. Many consider the thigh as the best and tastiest part of the chicken. Whole wings This is one of the most popular parts of the chicken. Whole wing includes the tip, the midsection, and dramet, or the portion of white meat between shoulder and elbow. Whole wings are essentially the entire wing without the giblets. 8-piece cut The whole bird is cut into two breast halves with ribs and back portion, two wings, two thighs with back portion, and two drumsticks. The parts may be packaged together and labeled as whole cut of chicken. These are usually sold without giblets. Wing meat section the section between the elbow and the tip that is sometimes called the wing flat or mid joint. Guidelines when buying poultry In choosing live chicken, choose alert, healthy, well feathered, and well formed chicken. The eyes should be bright and alert. The body of the fowl is free from skin injuries. They should have a good fat covering, free of tears, broken bones, bruises, and blisters. Choose younger chicken because they are more tender, but take note that older chicken have a better flavor. Tip of breastbone should be flexible. It has plump and well-round body. The skin should be clean, smooth, and pliable. In choosing dressed chicken, take note that these are slaughtered poultry with head, feet, and viscera intact. The chicken should be clean, well-fleshed, have a moderate fat covering, free from pin feathers, and show no cuts. Avoid those with missing parts, broken bones, and discoloration. Ready to cook. These are slaughtered poultry cleaned and eviscerated with feet and head removed. These are usually available either chilled or frozen in supermarkets. Chilled poultry should not be kept in the refrigerator for more than 3 days. That's it for today. We will continue our lesson on the next video. As always, thank you for watching and see you on the next video. Take care! Bye!